Welcome back to Daybreak. Look who my friend is here. It's Patty Spittler for Pet Pals TV. Hello. You have a really cute all pet moment to show us. Yes, we do. You know, ain't nothing but a hound dog. Yeah. Well, you sort of remember that. Uh, we have, uh, this is from Vote Carpet and Flooring, and Elvis is their hound dog. He is at their shop, and he's singing. Right now, though, he's singing with his family. Hit it, Elvis. <laughs> to go viral. Yes, I, I love it. <laughs> and if you go in the shop, he comes right up and he'll sing you in the shop. Oh. I love that. He's such a good boy. <laughs> I love it. I also love that we have a skunk in the studio. I never thought I'd say that in a positive and happy way. <laughs> no, a skunk is a pet, and Megan and Thomas have gizmo. We have more coming yes. up on Pet Pals TV, but they did the research. I always say, I don't care what you get, take care of it for life, and you knew what you wanted, right? Yes, Megan? yeah, and there's a, you go into it, like we really looked up what their care is like, because it's not like you buy a bag of dog food at the store and put yeah. it in a bowl and call it a day. Um, <laughs> We had to skunk proof the house, <laughs> so there's a lot of. So what does yeah. that mean? So he's a digger. You can tell by uh -huh, his. He's got some claws. <laughs> uh, so we had to put baby gates. We don't have kids, but we have baby gates all over the house. You um, have dogs too, right? Yeah, we have three dogs. Okay. So okay. And they all get along. Yeah. Yep. His Instagram page has a bunch of uh, videos of them interacting. Gizmo uh, has an Instagram page. Yeah. <laughs> Logging on to that next. But the heel, he'll play with them and stuff. It's funny. So tell me more. I mean, I have so many questions. Yeah, like, we I could know. Probably this is so many. <laughs> yeah. We're going to learn all about it on Pet Pals TV. Yeah. But, I mean, he's so cuddly. He just hangs out with you and is huggable. And, you know, of course, he... What, what's the process called that he no longer descended? Okay, yeah, he's yep. so, so they do it when they're babies, so really young, two to four weeks old usually. So he is the breeder he came from does it. So it's really, um, I mean, he doesn't have an odor at all. We bathe him once a month, maybe. So uh, he's been fixed. In yep, and way. he's neutered. So okay. you neuter him before six months of age. Okay. Uh, even in exotic, a great clinic here in Indy is his primary vet. Um, what would you say it's closely, most closely associated? Is he like a cat? Is he like a dog? I asked that same you, have, <laughs> you, you have three dogs. Like, what is his personality like? I think he's a mix, a perfect mix of both. Really? Really. Because, like, he will be playful and cuddly like a dog. He loves to lay on us. But then when he's done, he's done. And he will he's got the be, he, like yeah, a cat. like a cat. <laughs> so, yeah, he, he really is the best of both. He has a ball pit. And the yeah. coloring, <laughs> we, I think we were expecting black and white, but yeah. when they're, they're bred for, as pets, you said they come in different colors, right, yeah. Thomas? Is that right? Yeah, um, they come in several colors. Uh, out in the wild, they're usually black and white, but um, here, once they're kind of, I guess, domesticated or whatever, uh, <laughs> He's, he's called a, a brown like chocolate and his chocolate. little belly here has oh. a bunch of spots. So he's like chocolate what? chip colored. Yeah. Um, okay. There's, you know, tan and there's, there's even lighter colors. He, he white. hasn't missed many lunches, no. has he? <laughs> no. He's a little chunky. Nope. <laughs> what do they eat? Oh, oh. Bell, bell peppers, <laughs> yeah. apparently. Bell peppers, <laughs> apples. <laughs> I mean, I, when I meal peppers prep on Sundays, favorite. I meal prep for him. Look at so peppers, apples, blueberries, chicken, chicken grubs, Looks grasshoppers. Like he's got some sharp chompers in there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. When he was little, he 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 got us a couple times, but like puppies do. <laughs> yeah. They have those needle yeah. sharp yeah. teeth. Although I don't know that his ever are gonna change. Right? No, no. Nope. no. <laughs> How they're old is he? Nine months. Oh, he is. Yeah, a baby. so he's a baby. Yeah. How they're, much bigger will he get? Uh, they're prone to obesity, so hopefully not much bigger. Oh, right, sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, hopefully, yeah. This size is pretty much it. Like nine to ten pounds on average. What what do people say to you when you tell them you have a skunk as a pet? Oh. I feel like people think we're weird. <laughs> oh yeah, one hundred percent. People think we're insane. But like, then they meet them and they're like, okay, now yeah, like it's once you meet him and you see he's more normal than you think. People oh, are. I'm in love. Much I've only more seen him for about five minutes. And I got to pet him before we went on. Now, and we, you soft. brought your roller for your dress, right? Yeah, because so he look, sheds. Look at this. There's his Instagram. Yeah. He's got his own pen. How do we follow him? What's his uh, handle? It's at Gizmo the Skunk. Okay. Yep. 
He also has a Facebook page, but we don't pay as yeah, much attention yeah, to that. that yeah. Okay. <laughs> so there's a lot of videos of him with the dogs. On Instagram. So you can see so much more about Gizmo on Pet Pals TV today after daybreak. It. Thank you so much. This is a lot of fun, yeah. guys. Thank you for bringing him in. You're welcome. Get you with your picture over there. I'll, okay. I'll do that okay, in a we'll second. I'm going to send it to Marcus uh, right more now. On Pet Pals TV with yeah. uh, Mastiffs, too. We talk about okay, know cool. what you're getting, know your breed, and it's a stinker of a day. Let's go. Uh, uh, you had to squeeze that one in real quick, didn't you, Patty?